Hey everyone, Clay Plays Games here today. I am back with more LEGO Fortnite Hardcore Survival. Got a pretty good episode for y'all, but before we go into it, if y'all enjoy this episode and want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already, make sure to share this with your friends, share this with your family, share this with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on so you never miss any one of my videos when they go up. Also, if you feel like becoming a member and want to see these videos early, y'all go check out the join button on my channel or check out the link down in the description below. Also, make sure to use Clay Plays Games in the Fortnite item shop. That's C-L-A-Y-P-L-A-Y-Z-G-A-M-E-S. All capitalized or all lowercase. All put together in a nice little row. So let's get into it. Last episode, I was trying to find Triggerfish. Uh, unfortunately, I did not find him. But I dug through some artifacts that I found in a cave. I actually did a little bit of, you know, somewhat farming. I tried to do a little farming, but not too much. You know, just to kind of keep the feel of... You know, we're all doing this at the same time in a way. But I found some artifacts while going through uh, a cave that was nearby my house. And I found these artifacts that were leading me to a mysterious character known as Triggerfish, from what I believe. And all it says, like, in terms of directions, pick a direction and go straight. So I'm heading just in this direction. I doubt that this will actually work. But from what it said was to keep going straight and I can't even tell if I'm going straight anymore because I've already lost the direction of the path. So I'm hoping to just follow this kind of direction and hopefully find Triggerfish. It says he will be chilling by a cave or not by a cave by a maybe by a cave who knows but he will be chilling by a campfire wondering why he's by himself in this lonely expert world i don't understand it either i'm kind of alone too because i got thrown into this mess for anyone that doesn't know uh, if you don't know what i'm talking about um, i highly recommend watching i think whichever episode it was where i play as not really the uh the default skin. what well, i don't remember what his name is but blonde hair purple jumpsuit outfit that's it was only like four or five episodes ago. Like not not too bad, but it, I I don't know I don't know how it happened. Oh, I know where what it was. It was one two yeah three episodes ago. See, I can remember. I can do math. I know exactly where I'm at. Oh, I don't even know where I'm at right now. Holy crap! I'm about to head to the Frostland. But for anyone that doesn't know, I was on my own hardcore world, doing my own thing, with my own set of rules. I went into a cave that I normally do, and then when I went back out, I got thrown into this a mess of an expert world. And I don't know how to get back. I don't know if I can get back. And if I can't, I'm going to do the best I can with uh, just making this world my own. Okay, so... I don't... I don't ooh, but, okay, there, there is a cave over there. Maybe, maybe over here. Oh crap, this is the Star Wars cave. Okay, well there's the cave that I mentioned in the artifact, okay. So he's gonna be chilling by, okay, he's gonna be chilling by a campfire near a cave. Oh, this might be him. We might have actually found Triggerfish. I might, I might have gotten lucky here. That's the, like, I see smoke in the air and I see a big purple, or not a big purple thing, I saw blue, like, shock system little thing whatever you call it the blue lightning sound like effect guys we found trigger fish he's just chilling what the what the heck hold on we got we got you know celebrate this moment let's go I, I i got lucky i i knew it said buy a cave buy a campfire and i like I, I just kept going in that one direction i didn't know we were that close to the frost biome though but holy crap um well i might need a Hold on. I'm going to talk to him. I know from what I've seen in the legend that he'll give you a, a totem. Hey, you there. Nice to find a fellow survivor out here. I'm Triggerfish. Welcome to One Wild Rod. Clay plays games. Let's work together. We'll need to be survival experts to build a life here. Take this totem of return. It will give you a second chance if things get too hot. Yeah, I'll admit, I'm glad not to be alone out here. This place is seriously dangerous, as in... More dangerous than usual. We should prepare ourselves. Okay, bah. Well, 
Uh, I don't know about you, but I don't think you need to be here, so I'm gonna break your little campfire, and I'm gonna hope that you just magically appear back in my own, like, my, my own village. So we'll see how that turns out, and if you don't show up, then I apologize, but, you know, you're, you're there, and I found the Star Wars cave as well, apparently, so, that's a thing. I didn't even think that was, I didn't even know where that was, to be honest with y'all. I, I can't believe that was here, though. So, we got lucky, we found it without the binoculars. Actually, oh, but I need, I need that roller and I need that wolf. So I'm going to get both y'all in a, a little group meetup. So let's, let's all do it. Let's do it to it, everyone. Come on. Oh, shoot. That's bad. I'm glad. Oh, I didn't even put on the totem. I still have the totem, but I haven't used it. I was, oh, I think I just saw Triggerfish. I think Triggerfish is about to help me out here. I have no idea. Buddy, you don't have to do that, you know. Okay, hold on. Oh, come on. I really need the wolf and the roller to start, you know, working against each other. What is the... Oh, the wolf is sp finding the spider? Are you kidding me? Uh, how is the wolf losing? That doesn't make any sense. Hold on, hold on, hold on, I'm sorry. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, a two for one sale. Let's go. Now, where's that roller? Get over here. Oh, you were barely, like, you, you never took damage. That's insane. Oh, but Triggerfish also lost his fight, so I don't know where he's going to end up at. I still gotta find my own base. That's what's funny. Okay, I'm gonna wait, wait, slide. Imagine sliding me in the game, that'd be cool. Okay, so I got you covered. Maybe if I can attract the attention of the wolf. Okay, well, it did damage to the wolf. I'm just trying to cheat my way at this point into this world. Holy crap, it, it, it just exploded. Oh, does it not eat the meat? I thought it did. No, that might be the brute. That's the brute and which else? It's another creature. I think it's those little shells over on the beach. Actually, what did those turn into? Those little crabs. Okay. Actually, if I if I take another thing of damage, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose. Crap. Okay. Well, I gotta do this to the best of my abilities and not lose. Also, for anyone wondering, I'm playing a Spider Gwen. They changed some new, like they fixed some characters for the Marvel stuff, like for the Lego Fortnite stuff. And I mentioned it last. No, it was either last. I think I mentioned it last episode as well. The last episode and two episodes ago, I did mention that they did change the skins a while back, and I just hadn't noticed. So there's a, a couple of new skins that I'm going to be playing as for these next couple of episodes. At least going to try to. Um, I got one for next episode. I'm gonna be, I think next episode will be Moon Knight because that is a skin that was also changed. And I mentioned that one last episode. I, no, that one was two episodes ago. I don't remember. I've lost. I've lost track of days. I've been on this world so long that I don't remember who I am or where I'm at. But I think I remember the trail. So if I do this rot. I should just have to go back onto this like little trail area and head left. And if I'm lucky, the beacon I set up a while back should be, you know, what I need. Uh, do I really want to? I have to find with my fist. It's just difficult when there's multiple. Actually, you know what? Since they got to work on some of them, I'm actually going to steal some of the bones from here. Actually, I'm going to use their help. Holy crap. One, two, three, four, five, six. Holy crap. Y'all are about to hit me. Holy crap. Actually, I can't pick any of that up. That's that's part of the Star Wars stuff that's not really available yet to me, in a way, because I'm saving that for last. So a lot of that is going to be later. And holy crap. And for some reason, my running is a little messed up. I don't know why. I'm just stealing the bones and the pickaxe. I'm not stealing anything else. Actually, I might want to just move around. 
I need... Okay. This is not going to work out well for me. He's not even able to do much either. Okay. Well, that's pretty much everything. I don't think I need anything else at this point. So I'm going to run for a while and try not to get caught. And so I, met, I noticed it here. So I should just have to take a left. And then should be scot-free. I just got to head straight. It was the same pathing, I think. Ugh, this is going to be a tough one. Oh, and there's some stuff there. I need... I need food. I'm just going to keep running for a while. I'm not even going to activate the NPCs for that. I'm leaving everyone be for now. Ugh. I don't know where to go. There needs to, there really just needs to be like a whole, like a really big beacon. I want to be able to craft my own beacon. Let's see. Straight ahead. Past the water. I need to look for the lake. Once I find the lake, I'm good. Because there is that giant lake that I can pass. But I don't know where that is. I gotta just... I gotta focus. Gotta think about this. Now, if I'm lucky, though, Triggerfish will be back at my base. Or somewhat base. I don't know where he'll end up at. But I do have, a, like, I have, like, three campfires there. So it shouldn't be a problem. Okay, that's where the ship is. This is the lake. Okay, so I can go over to, to the left. Perfect. I can do that. That's very easy. And so far, they're still chasing me. So we're going to run for now. I've got my dagger out, but I don't know if I can really use it. I don't know. I feel like the cave ones, because those seem tougher. So maybe for the cave skeletons, I use it. Or, like, I get to, like, half. Holy crap. Um, yeah, no, that's not what we're doing today. No, thank you. You can... You, you, you go take a bath in, the, in that lake of yours. God, it's right... They're, they're right behind me. I need, I need to go. I need to book it. Is it almost daytime? Please tell me it's almost daytime. Yep, it's almost daytime, so they should be leaving here in a minute. I need to go get the, st the storm cores now that I'm thinking about it. I need more of them. I may... I don't know. I'll hold on to the Totem of Return, but y'all can let me know what y'all want me to do about it. And since I have some more wood, I'm going to place another uh, another campfire here. And one here. So this is our beacon, in a way. It's just going to provide a big smoke lawn in the sky, so hopefully we'll be able to see it. Now, did Triggerfish ever show up? Captain Bravera is here. Wait a minute. What if I do a what if I place a bed? Can that just automatically send him here? What about it? What about it? no? Oh no. Oh no. He's not here. I shouldn't I shouldn't Oh crap. I took his totem of return. And he didn't get to use it himself. Oh, no. I feel bad. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm, I'm going to make a food processor. I don't know if that's really necessary. But I'm going to make one anyway. Just to have it. But, actually, with the axe, though, I can go and get not root. Man. I, I'm just... Man, I, I, I thought I would be able to have him back in my village. I guess once the, the NPCs just you know, kick kick it to the curb, they're just done. I'm guessing. I haven't really thought about it too much. Mm. Alright, time to time to send me in here. I'm gonna get all the knot root that's in this front area that's not gonna be flooded with skeletons and rollers. That's what I would prefer. But this way I can grab what I need and I can eventually make a pickaxe as well. So I kinda need it well no, it's better to have it in my like inventory, my ready to go inventory. Because let me think. It makes more room in my inventory. So I can grab more stuff. Sorry. I I feel like ever since I made it to this world crap, I need to make sure my audio didn't just mess up. I accidentally pulled on a cord and my my little headset thing is turned to I don't know, I got worried for a second. I didn't know whether or not that messed with the entire thing. 
Hopefully not. We'll find out after uh, after I finish recording this. We'll see how it goes. Maybe I'm worrying over nothing. But it's gonna make more room in my inventory. Speaking of which, let me put this meat in here as well. And I'm gonna have extra spaces for stuff. So I'm gonna grab this knot root, make a pickaxe, and then grab marble. I need marble. And then eventually I'll be able to make a stone breaker. Hopefully. Actually, I can also cook the food too that I have. There's so much I can do. So, home is here. It doesn't really provide a big smoke thing in there. Now that I'm thinking about it. I was looking at that one, but even this one, same. Still not a whole lot. So. Gonna put this all up. I Wait a minute. That sound. Where is it? Is that it? Wait a minute. I knew I heard it. Okay, so... Oh, man, but that's so far, though. Okay, well, it's straight ahead that way, unless it's in the... Crap, okay. Well... I don't know what to do about it. I don't have, really, the inventory space. Let me place, like, five more. I was gonna, I, I was gonna do one thing, but I'm gonna change my mind right now. I wanna go get the supply drop... If we're gonna put those up. We're gonna put like all of that up. Anything that I really don't need right now, especially that, just to keep an eye on my inventory. Okay, so it was about that way, I think. Ugh, we need we need to go get it. We should go get it. Now I don't know how I did it, but like two worlds back, like like two series ago. Yeah, it was two series. No, well, no, the, we're on the same series. So it was technically last series where I was doing my own thing, where I was on the Star Wars island. Yeah, most of y'all know what I'm talking about. But I did a thing where I managed to, like, glitch the game in a weird way, and I ended up having, like, three or four uh, supply drops around the same area. I still don't know how, but it was, like... I guess, like, if you don't grab it, and then you just let it... You know, you let it be. Oh, here it is. Wait, that seemed like a lot farther. I mean, is it the same one? It could be the same one. Who knows? I'm gonna get it, though. Sweet. That's the... That's the first one I've grabbed in a while on this... In, in this entire series alone. I haven't really messed with them a whole bunch. I just kind of let them be. They're not really that... I don't know. Sometimes I just don't have anything worth it. Sweet, I leveled up again. I've been working on getting the power suit armor skin. Still a little upset that they don't have the any Fallout, like a Lego Fortnite version for Fallout. Because I would really love that. And I've talked about it before, but they need to have, you know, not like the, like, it's like the default skins wearing, you know, themed outfits. So like the soccer skins or the football skins. It's just the default skins wearing outfits. So you just have the default skins wearing Fallout suits, like the blue jumpsuit stuff. Like that just seems like that would make sense. I don't know why they wouldn't do that though, but who knows? But that that's something I would have done personally. That way uh, you can have a skin in Fortnite because all it would be is just the character with a blue jumpsuit with a number on the back. That just makes sense. Uh, do we need an already? What do we need for the pickaxe? We'll end this with the pickaxe. I need the bones. Please tell me I got bones. I got bones. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. I got worried. I was about to say, it's like if I... I need so much stuff, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it. Okay, I'm noticing just the charms. and Okay, cool head charms, so that's still a thing. Certain, certain ones are still available. So, oh, crap. Jeez, buddy. My cat, he was sleeping, and he fell off the dresser. Good grief, buddy. He's not careful whatsoever. He just kinda, He's just kind of careless. You know what I mean? Like, where, where cats just kind of don't care, so they just kind of roll over and fall anyway. Oh, my poor baby. He is... He's not... He's just kind of... He's tired. To put it that way, he's just tired. It's so he doesn't care if he falls over. Guys, like, I, I had to look over at him. It's like, buddy, are you okay? Well, I'm also trying to get not root rods so I can make a pickaxe. Oh, boy. Okay. So we're going to make this. That will be soon. 
I'll get this. The next episode, I'll work on getting marble. And actually, what can I make? Is there anything else that I can make before I end this? Any stations? Okay, I do need a spinning wheel. Oh, um, mm -mm. actually, I'm looking at it, looking at it. I think I can do it. I think I might be able to also make the food processor. So, if I want it... I want that there. Well, oh, I'm missing one. Okay. We can make one plank. That's no problem. It's going to put us at nine things of wood. But I'm thinking here... Actually, what if... No, 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 no. Never mind. But the, the food processor can go, like, like right here. I can do that. That'll be fine. Awesome. So, turn it to be this way, because that's how it needs to look. That could be... That's center. Awesome. Okay, so we're going to have, like, stations all throughout the place, and I'll move some of this if I need to. But with the, the silk... Uh, fat or the silk, just the silk, I can make silk threads, and that's going to be needed for when we start making totems of returns. I think once we just get multiple ones or have a lot of stuff available, we just need a lot of storm cores, but we've got the claws, the shells, and we're about to have the threads. Next episode, I'm going to try and get more marble, but definitely more storm cores, and hopefully make a totem of return. And that'll be the plan for next episode. And hopefully by the time I come back, maybe Triggerfish will be here. I'm getting rid of the bed because I don't have a, I got really a purpose for it. I thought that would just cause him to be here, but unfortunately not. So if I if I come if I get back on the game and he shows up, then that's perfect. But this is where I'm going to leave it for this episode. If y'all enjoy this video and want to see more videos like this, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to share this with your friends, share this with your family, share this with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on so you never miss any one of my videos when they go up. Also, if you feel like becoming a member and want to see these videos early, y'all go check out the join button on my channel or check out the link down in the description below. Uh, also, make sure to use Clay Plays Games in the Fortnite Arm Shop. That's C-L-A-Y-P-L-A-Y-Z-G-A-M-E-S, all capitalized or all lowercase, all put together in a nice little row. I think I completely botched this outro and I apologize. But I will see you on the next one. So, with all of that being said, thank you all so much for watching this episode, and have a great day.